Come test your brains with the world's hardest riddles. Let's see if we can solve these. Jill called the police. Uh-oh, what's happened? <gasps> My husband is dead. Jeez, poor woman. Poor guy. He didn't come home from work yesterday. <gasps> oh my gosh. I was waiting for him all night long. Well, how does she know she, he's dead? Is he found? Is she found him? And in the morning, I found him dead by the door. Jeez. Uh, poor guy. Who did it? That's the question. The police arrived at the crime scene and questioned all these people. Oh, Simon. My brother's called Simon. Maybe he did it. I woke up when Jill began screaming. Okay. I rushed to her house. Remember, keep all of these answers in your head and saw her standing by her dead husband. What if it's the wife? I came from the club late at night. Maybe he went out to a club with Leela and fell asleep. I didn't hear anything. Hmm, well, apparently she screamed, so okay. I was so worried that I couldn't get to sleep until 4 a.m. I slept for a couple of hours, okay, till about 6, 7 maybe. Then got up and went to look for George. Hmm, so far I'm kind of suspect of a second girl. And found him right in front of the house. Oh my gosh, who do you think it is? Oh, this is a tough one, this is a tough one. I think it could be Leela, because she said she didn't hear anything. But who do you guys think? Hmm. Jill, why is it always the wife? Of Jill, what did you do? Oh, when she called the police, she said that she hadn't slept at all. But then when she gave a statement, she said she slept for a few hours. Her story was being muddled up. You had to pay attention for that one. Congrats if you did. If you did, hit the thumbs up button. Let me know that you've got a big brain. Smash that like button. Alan, a prison guard, had got a note. The prisoners were sharing during the day. Very, very suspect. The note was encrypted. Hmm. It says nothing on it. Alan wasn't smart enough to crack it. Come on, Alan. I believe. Look, if you can't do it, we'll help you out, all right? He's going to show the note to the warden. Okay. Maybe the warden can help him out. Was the warden... Guys, we're going to have to help these people out. Clearly, our brains are a little bit bigger than these people. <gasps> they failed to prevent the jailbreak. Oh, my God. Gosh, what could they have done? Oh my good gracious me. Can we crack the code? Five, one, six, one. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. What if we take the, the numbers and align them? So first one would be J, second would be A, I, then L. Yeah, jail, this works, this works. Jail, two, B, br break, jailbreak on this side, six, at, jailbreak at, four, four, two, one, one, 14, is it AM or PM, two, one, AM, wait, 11, 11 AM, dude, I think we did it, that was fun, have we cracked it, let's take a look, yes, lining up each of the numbers with the work, come, I'll be honest, that wasn't the hardest thing in the world. I can't believe that those police officers, and you know, didn't stop this jailbreak. We would have done it, though, guys. We would have known when it was going to be happening. We need a bigger challenge. So who has escaped from prison? Let's work this one out. Hmm. <gasps> Spotted it. For a second, I was like, wait a second. All of these people look extremely normal. But then when you take a closer look, I noticed that man should be in prison. Who else has escaped from prison? Mm, girl on the bench looks like she's texting very angrily. Guy's got a laptop on the right. And a, that guy's got weird ginger. Is he got a disguise on? You see that? He's got a disguise on. He's trying to blend in so that people don't recognize him. Oh, who escaped from prison? Um, Any of these guys escaped from prison? Oh, the girl on the left's got, like, the prison hat on. I think, I don't know how she got, I don't know how she got all the other swimwear clothes and is chilling with random people. Why would you keep the hat on? You know what, it's fine. We worked out, that's the main thing. Who else is escaping from prison here? Uh, uh, oh, has he got the, the, the jacket on? The prison jacket on. I think it's the fourth guy in. These people got to take their prison clothes off when they escape. You know what I mean? Who else is going to escape here? Let's find out. Ooh, there's a locked key. Got some books in there. 
This lady looks like she's got a plan she's trying to hatch. Which one will escape? Hmm. This... Uh, oh. That person's got... That person... Is that real? Is that person got shoes on? Is that person on the right actually in the bed? I don't... I think it's the person on the right. Middle person looks like she wants to get out of it. Left person doesn't seem quite to care as much, but I mean, there's no signs that she's about to break out. I'm just saying, if I'm a police officer guard and I see a bed like that, that looks like they're pretending to be there. They've propped up shoes and they've propped up some head things so they can jump out and make- Oh wait, there's a hole in the in the bars as well. Yeah, fate, but dude, I, I am too good. I would know this straight away. No one will be escaping from our prisons. That's what I'm saying, people. You know what I mean? Yeah, they're already out. There's literally a hole there as well. Who is the thief? Ooh, somebody's stolen something. Let's take a look. Keeper. Oh! Saw it. I was keeping an eye on them. All of their eyes are very much focused on the test they're doing, apart from one person. Can you spot it? That's right, that guy in the top, he's looking, uh, looking over, trying to nab something, little thief. Who's a thief here? Hmm. Got two maids. Two kids playing dress-up nurses. Wait a sec. She just stolen an Oscar. Is this person one and all? Look, 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 stealing a trophy. She's stolen about five already. You can't escape us. Yeah, 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 you get out of here. You're going into prison. Just saying. All right, this is going to be a little bit closer. Okay. Mm, top two people are on their phones and drinking. I don't think it's them. Bottom two... Uh, they seem to be chilling. Top right. That woman seems to be doing something weird with her hand. Wait, is she stealing cutlery? What are you doing? Uh, we found you. What about this person? Hmm. No one's actually in the pool. Notice that. Everyone's enjoying themselves, but no one's actually in the pool. Some people on the books, some people on the iPads. Woman's got like a speaker or something. She's jamming out to the music. Wait, what's she doing with that food? It's not a speaker, it's a bag. She's nabbing food. <laughs> Who's a thief here? Okay. Everyone looks very normal. Scanning the items, putting them in their bag. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait a second. What's that woman on the bottom right doing? She's just dropping things in her bag. Yeah, look, she's not scanning it. She just dropped it in. Uh, what did you reckon? Do you think it's the same person too? Louis and Laura are famous water skiers. Nice. I've never been water skiing. It doesn't look easy. Can't lie. They usually spend the holidays at sea. Of course they do. They're water skiing. <gasps> Ooh, going skiing. Is that similar? I think it'd be similar. I mean, it's just on snow, not water. It was his birthday when they left. Okay, so remember that. Birthday when he left. Without telling anyone about it. Okay, so he kept his birthday under wraps. He doesn't want to know how old he doesn't want everyone to know how old he is, you know what I mean? They checked in under false names. What why are they being so secretive? And went to the mountains. Okay. These people seem very suspect. Oh <gasps> the next day they were found dead. What the heck? Poor people. The police arrived at the crime scene. Hmm. Well, who killed them? Well, they must be wanted, surely. They found some gifts for Louis. Hmm. But nobody's meant to know that it's birthday. Which gift is suspicious? I think it's the bottom left, because before they went, nobody knew that they'd be going skiing. They normally go water. Yeah, exactly. They didn't tell anyone that they are going to be going skiing. So why did he get a woolly hat? Unless they knew that they were going to the mountains. This friend hates them, Harry. He hates them. I'm talking about bad things. There was a big storm on Monday night. Jeez, that is ripping through the town. And Shelby didn't come home. Oh no, this is not good. Her husband called the police. Oh no, what's happened here? <gasps> a famous detective arrived at their place. This guy looks like he means business. When, he, when they're not smiling, they are serious. Shelby's body was found outside the city in the meadows. Jeez, that's awful. <gasps> it looked like she was killed by lightning. Oh my god. Gosh, lightning strike. Now that is bad. However, the autopsy shows they weren't burned from electricity. That 
is wrong. It was a murder. Oh, who did it? And does this storm have anything to do with it? The detected had three suspects. Husband, Gary, a secret lover, or Sam, the brother. He also found a note. I know who killed her, but I can't tell his name. I'll give you a hint. That day I saw her drinking Sambuca and dancing Samba in a bar. Oh, oh, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Guys, what is within the word Sambuca and Samba? Sam, they're trying to give away the name. The brother did it. Did you get that one as well? Is your brain big? I'm sure it is, guys. We hate Sam, though. If you're Sam watching right now, I like you. Don't worry. Just that Sam specifically. James and Molly have been married for five years. Congratulations. But they haven't been on a vacation yet. Jeez, these people have been working hard. Where are they going to go on a vacation then? They decide to go to the ocean. A very, very unspecific place to go, but okay. To get there, they have to cross the border. Ah, okay. Leaving the old city, are they off on a little vacay? Nice. You have to tell me the password if you- What the? There's a password to get out? That's, you know, no wonder they've never gone anywhere. Oh my gosh, okay. What's the password? Bench tree apple. Okay, the number of benches is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Trees is one, two, three, six. The six, I think, apples is one. I think, what, 961, I think? Let me know if my counting's a little bit off there. I've counted the double benches as two. One, two, three, yeah. Oh wait, it's none of the double benches. I got the first one wrong, second one right. Third one, oh, I tried to be over, overly clever. They wouldn't have let me out, guys. Would they have let you out? Probably. At least they got to enjoy their beautiful ocean vacation. I'll be stuck in the city. <laughs> Ooh, who's leaving prison? This is a big one. She's got lipstick on. That means she's trying to, like, get ready to leave. She's eating her meal. Looking all fancy. Is she trying to look good for her escaping? Or is that a bit too suspect? Her shoes are on. Again, could be a key reason for the fact that she's going, but her plate of food is empty. She seems really sad. And she's got her food there uneaten. And she also has her shoe on. It's something to do with the food. If you're going to escape prison, would you leave your food or would you eat it? Surely you'd eat it for energy, but then if you knew you were getting out, maybe you wouldn't eat it because the food's rubbish. This is tough, guys. Which one do you think? Let me know she doesn't want to eat because she's leaving soon and can't wait for a better meal. That one was really tough. Anna, Mia, and Ellie are best friends and hit woman. Oh my gosh, these people are savage. They're suspected of a crime. They're already in prison and kept in isolation cells. Uh, okay, all of them have been put away. They're accused of killing a guy. Oh my gosh, guys, which one is it? We have to put our brains together here. The judge offers them a plea bargain. Okay. If one of them confesses and tells him the details, she will be released. Ooh. I'll never tell you who did it, but it wasn't me. Okay. So Anna's saying it wasn't her. I have no idea what happened to that guy. I mean, that's basically no information. I wasn't there when he died, but... Doesn't mean that she didn't do something to cause him to die. Mia did it. She's a sleepwalker. Huh. She woke me up last night and said she killed that guy. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. I mean, I mean, Ellie's literally saying it was Mia. Mia's saying that she wasn't there, but she's a sleepwalker. Ellie lies, really? The girls are in isolation cells. Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. Uh, they couldn't confess, of course. Did you guys pick up on that? I got completely fooled. Uh, it's almost Christmas. Santa is heading home after a long working night. If you're excited for Christmas as well, subscribe to the channel for Christmas cheer spirit and good wishes and the wind had been howling non-stop all day long when he came home 
and warmed up with a nice cup of tea. I mean, personally, I'd go for a little hot chocolate. He realized that one of his deer has been stolen the present. Oh my gosh, his deer's stolen the present. Jeez. Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, and Vixen came immediately. What was each of you doing two hours ago? Dasher, I was decorating the windows. Okay, you got a giant sack. When I saw someone by your sleigh. This is going to be a tough one, guys. We need big brains here. I was sitting by the fire inside the house when I heard the sleigh bells outside. Okay. I was helping Mrs. Claus wrap the presents when I saw a shadow outside. Okay. Vixen, I was asleep when something fell on me when I woke up. It's Christmas Eve. I'm very sad to find out that one of you has been naughty. <gasps> Oh, this is a tough one, people. Can you work it out? I'm most suspect of Dancer because he's the only one that said he's heard anything. Everyone else just said they saw something. So why would he be the only one to hear anything? Plus, isn't it like it's winter? Like, we oh, he said he heard. Yeah, he said he heard bells. It is Dancer. It was a wind. It's literally snowing. It's windy. You never would have heard it. Dancer, you got caught, my friend. No presents for you. Guys, more videos on screen here. Click to keep on watching. I'll see you over there.